Friday, November 20th, 2015. The Purpose of Stories We tell stories through movies and series produced by expensive studios paying skilled actors. This allows for a better production and a more exciting display, but it also makes for less personal and less detailed narration, as is available through simple word of mouth. Folk stories were passed on according to place and time. They changed narration to fit the situation, to give the best value in the form of education, whether moral or practical. They were heeded and used, and while entertaining, also raised caution and curiosity in the listeners. In stark contrast to word of mouth, media productions are not better than eye candy and plain entertainment. They fail to make the audience learn from others, but instead encourage mimicking of character without any understanding of cause and effect. This is how we get a culture of people behaving like retards trying to be popular. Even now, people sit alone in front of their computer, television and phone screen. More alone than ever before, as media has become so accessible privately. For studying, this is a great boon. You can study anything, anytime, anywhere. But for socializing, a more urgent need, we no longer tell stories and figure those stories out in groups.